this one we'll talk about how we split a list let's see how we are going to split a list this too as you remember from the previous script so what i'll be doing let's let's copy this again and paste it here and maybe what we can do is preview this off and preview this off for the performance updates preview this off as well alongside this one so let's me let me grab a one rectangle again here creating a rectangle having this guy over here now what we're gonna do is we'll be talking about splitting a list so how we do how we split a list so let me see split list here so what this basically does it takes a list and if within a given index specific index it cuts that list so if i put this 50 if i put this 20 and if i preview this or if i grab a point list here and these are my point list and if i grab a maybe like if i take this here copy and paste down below as well so what we are seeing here is basically the points, right? And I can maybe increase this by editing this to, I don't know, 25. So, 0.25. So what this basically does, if I connect this over here, and then like, let's say I want to cut this in from index 10, right? So what this will create is going to be two lists. List A is going to have the points that are ranging from 0 to 10. And list B is going to be the points that are ranging from 10 to 50. So if I now, this time, copy this and paste it, and probably I'll be doing this off. Putting this in, you see, starting from the point 10, in this case, it's 0.9. This is list B, all right? Sorry, this is list B, the ones that we see in white. And if I make it in red, you see them in red. And maybe a bit further translucent, and maybe 35 would be the number that I can show this. I copy this and paste this, and if I put it over here, now, what I'm seeing is, as let's say, blues is the ones that are the f consisting the first list of mine. So in this case, what I did is by using split list, oops, sorry. I just divide this point list into two lists. Okay. And you can see that we only have two list option here. List A is the first list, list B is the second list. And if you edit this, like let's say not to 10, but 100, 1000 maybe, even more. I say okay to this. And if I increase this, you see it's going up. So the number of blues are increasing because the number ranging from 0 to 26, in our case, it's going to be 0 to 25, it's going to be blues and the rest is gonna be the red. So this is relatively short and easy tutorial about splitting a list. And in the next one, we'll talk about more on how we can group some items in a particular list.